evening, not morning. No, it's dark. Welcome to episode 9, volume 1 of Iron Man Prep. If you're new here, this channel is just all about me documenting my training and my journey for my first ever full Iron Man this year in Iron Man Chattanooga, Tennessee. Those that have been following along, you know that I'm usually working out in the morning, but on my last video, different responsibilities took over my day. This is the only time I could do my long run that I usually do in the morning. It is a nice, chilly, raining Friday evening. What else would a runner want to do at this time of day? 8.2 miles, 8 minute, 33 second per mile pace, about an hour and 10 minutes. It's a good start to the weekend. Just like that, it is sunny and mid 50s again in Indiana. Just did about 1600 yards of swimming, about 45 minutes of weightlifting. Don't usually go to the pool on Saturdays, so it was packed, all the kids and family swimming, but they do reserve two lanes for lap swimmers. And believe it or not, that is five weeks total of Ironman prep. That was the end of week five. Next week is week six, and that is the end of phase one, mostly building off of the first two weeks of base training that I did. After next week, we will increase each discipline with a little more time. So with the week complete, let's go over this week's numbers. We did a little over 16 miles of running, uh, a little over two hours. We did three hours of biking, which was a little over 53 miles, about an hour and a half of weightlifting and 3,600 yards of swimming for a little over an hour, which is a little over two miles. That was a total of seven hours and 57 minutes of training this week also. Good solid week. Feeling a little fatigued since my routine has shifted the past two days. Not getting my workouts done in the morning when I'm full of energy and doing them midday or in the evening after I've had a full day of work. Uh, I've had a full day of eating, so you just feel sluggish and slow, but proud that we did not miss a day of training this week. We stuck to it, did my job, stayed committed. Now it's on to week six. We'll see you on Monday. Happy Monday. What in the world am I doing? Running in the afternoon daytime. <laughs> well, for one, it's nice out. Two, I've been down sick the past two days. So I'm not really, my schedule's all out of whack. My training schedule's out of whack, my work schedule. So we're making adjustments this week. Monday, starting with the long run today. Beginning of week six, Ironman prep. A little over 57 minutes, seven miles at an eight minute, 12 second per mile pace. I do not feel good, but got it done anyways. Hopefully tomorrow I wake up feeling back to normal. Happy Tuesday. About 50 minutes of weightlifting, bench press, incline bench press, and dips, pull ups, and abs. And then I wanted to swim a mile today. Just not even thinking about time, not even thinking about pace. So we did 
1,775 yards, 1,760 yards is a mile. Did that in about 40 minutes, mostly in zone three. I'll post that here too. If you don't have Garmin or even an Apple Watch, highly recommend getting those if you wanna test what your aerobic state is and what your heart rate level actually is when you're doing long endurance workouts because if you can keep it mid low level for a long period of time that's how you build up the cardiovascular endurance to actually be able to you know do longer races so overall decent workout i'm still not feeling 100 percent, so i just did what i could today and now it's off to work I have this saying that I created for myself and it goes, the prime of your life is where you are right now. It's baffling to me how so many people work for the desires and needs of others, yet don't have the respect to do the same for themselves. Constantly stuck in a story of self-doubt and excuses on why you can't be great, both professionally and personally. Our excuses are liars and our doubts are thieves. It's exhausting being a part of this global community that chases fame, success, shopping and acquiring better things instead of investing in a better self. Indulged in endless responsibilities that steal our energy and lusting after unimportant pursuits that enslave us instead of liberating us. So many die at 30 and they're buried at 80 because they spent their life chasing these soul emptying habits. You are so much more powerful and capable than you truly understand. And you'll realize that once you see the prime of your life is where you are right now. Oh man, 9.53 miles, nine minute, four second per mile pace, hour 26. I've just got this pesky cough that I can't get rid of. I'm trying to recover, but still did it. Good morning, happy Thursday, did 1400 yards uh, lap swim a little over half an hour and then about 50 minutes of weightlifting today focusing on squats abs and biceps i don't film everything because that would be overkill get the gist of some of the main workouts that i do felt good today uh finished with six sprints was moving very efficiently very quick felt strong but that is it for episode nine of iron man prep i'll be right back at it tomorrow morning friday we got the bike ride i'll see you in the next one Thank you.